Hey there, Steeler Nation! When everyone expected the news to be over, last-minute updates arrived. That's right. The arrival of one of the most coveted wide receivers in the NFL, Brandon Ayuk, has been heavily speculated in recent weeks, and Tomlin said something that surprised the media about it. But that's not all, because the Steelers have just confirmed another player on our team. If you're a big fan of the Steelers, leave your like and let's go to the video amid ongoing rumors about wide receiver Brandon Ayuk potentially leaving the San Francisco 49ers after a breakdown in contract extension talks. The Pittsburgh Steelers have emerged as a potential destination. Ayuk, who has been a standout player since entering the league, would significantly bolster Pittsburgh's receiving core if acquired. The Steelers, who are positioning themselves with a strong receiver lineup, including George Pickens as their top option, followed by Calvin Austin III, Van Jefferson, and Quez Watkins, could see a massive upgrade with someone of Ayuk's caliber. The addition would be particularly beneficial given the team's recent revamp at quarterback, featuring new signings Russell Wilson and Justin Fields. When Steelers head coach Mike Tomlin was questioned Wednesday about the team's interest in strengthening their receiver group further, his response was cryptic. According to Josh Alper of Pro Football Talk, Tomlin offered a grin and chose not to provide a direct answer, saying, I'll let you guys speculate on that. While Tomlin's response doesn't provide clear confirmation, his demeanor could suggest that the Steelers are seriously considering a move for Ayuk. It seems more certain that the New England Patriots, previously thought to be in the mix, are no longer contenders. Matt Mayoko of NBC Sports Bay Area reported that despite a substantial offer from the Patriots, Ayuk showed no interest in joining them. As the situation unfolds, it's clear that Ayuk's destination for the 2024 season is still up in the air, but the Steelers appear to be front runners in the chase for the dynamic receiver. This potential acquisition could make Pittsburgh's offense one of the most talked about in the league. While we anxiously await Ayuk's confirmation, let's move on to news that promises to strengthen our defense. Don't leave there because there's more good news coming. The Pittsburgh Steelers have once again signed safety Jalen Elliott, marking his fourth stint with the team within a year. This latest re-signing comes as the team navigates through some recent setbacks in their secondary. Elliott, a Notre Dame alum, was initially cut from the team on July 17th to make room for the return of special teams expert Tyler Matakevich. Despite not playing in any regular season games last year, Elliott has been a familiar face around the team. He was released at the end of last year's training camp, but was quickly brought back to the practice squad by late October. After another release in November, he rejoined the squad in mid-December. The need for Elliott's return was pressed by the recent loss of starting free safety Minka Fitzpatrick, who was out with a knee injury this week, and strong safety DeMonte Kazi, who received a season-ending suspension from the NFL. After his periods with the Detroit Lions, New England Patriots, and Las Vegas Raiders, Elliott signed a reserve and futures contract with the Steelers this past January. Throughout his NFL career, Elliott has accumulated 12 total tackles. Elliott's preseason performance last year included playing in all three games, where he demonstrated solid tackling skills with a pro football focus, PFF, tackling grade of 71.3, and accumulated 11 tackles. However, he also faced challenges as he allowed 13 receptions on 13 targets for 108 receiving yards and two touchdowns during those games. At Notre Dame, Elliott played 44 games, showcasing his ability with six interceptions and 11 pass deflections, with his junior year being notably productive. This move by the Steelers is a strategic effort to bolster their defensive backfield depth as they navigate current challenges, hoping Elliott's familiarity with the team and his ongoing development will translate into effective play on the field. With the possible arrival of Brandon Ayuk and the return of Jalen Elliott, the Steelers are preparing for an electrifying season. If Ayuk really comes, our offense will be one of the most talked about in the league, and with Elliott back, our defense gains more depth and experience. What do you think of these movements? Leave your opinions in the comments and don't forget to click on the video that appears on your screen for more updates and exclusive analysis. To the next.